In this tutorial, I'll show you how to make this cool logo, reveal effect in DaVinci Resolve. Before we head on to this effect, for now on, I will post these tutorials once a week since I don't have that much free time at the moment. Let me know in the comments what kind of effects you all want to learn. Let's get to the video. First, you need to copy your clip. Open the clip in the color page, and as usual, take your pen tool and mask out a part of the car's paint. After that, add alpha output. Move to the sizing window and adjust the pan, tilt and zoom to hide the car's logo. Then go to tracker window. Press on frame and move to the beginning of the video and adjust it so it stays on the logo. Do the same for the last frame. Now you can add some softness to the outside. You can fix some points if the logo becomes visible. It looks good now. Copy the bottom clip to the top. Open it up in the color page and mask out the logo. Track the mask. If the tracking doesn't work, like for me, Press on the frame button and fix the points manually. Add alpha output for this too. Combine the two bottom layers into one new compound clip, and the top one also. Open the top one in Fusion page. We need to add DVE and Transform. Make a keyframe for center and size on the place you want the effect to end. Move few frames backwards and adjust the values so the logo is a bit higher than in the end. Go to the beginning and move the logo out of the frame. After that, select the DVE node and keyframe Y rotation. Move to the same point where you put the middle keyframe for transform and change the rotation value to 700. Go to the end of the effect and put the value to 1080. Open spline window. Smooth out the points by selecting all of the points and then pressing S on your keyboard. Last step is to apply Motion Blur to the Transform node by pressing on Settings and then selecting Motion Blur. That's basically it.